Hey everyone, all right, today I received yet another rejection from a job which I applied for. It was uh, the store, which I've been applying to stores because I'm familiar with that. I submitted another application for a warehouse job, which is for another chain of stores, for which I had also applied for another job recently and I got rejected for. <laughs> And, but then I received news that the person who's going to transport me is going to sell their car. And that person had told me, you know, go and apply for, you know, not just walking distance. I'll take you, I'll, I'll transport you. And now that I don't know what to do. And as far as trying to raise awareness to try to start a GoFundMe, I can't even do that because um that that's for the attorney fee because i've read that and it says do not speak to uh any law enforcement without an attorney present and i know from firsthand experience that that is 100 percent true because even if you're innocent they are trained to try to not manipulate but essentially that but they're trained to just catch even a little in inconsistency in anything you say, which anything that's happened, like I could barely remember what happened yesterday, three days ago, last week, let alone any time further back than that. And if you're asked questions about that, and also they can lie to you about, you know, what what they, what they're, you know, they can just lie about what their investigation is about, they can lie about who's involved. They can lie about um, what's going to happen in court. Uh, just about any scare tactic that you can think of, you can, you can pretty much put a safe bet that it's on the table. So even if you're innocent, I cannot attest enough to that the Fifth Amendment is the only thing you can use if you're in my position where you are poor can't afford to hire an attorney and um and essentially you can't you, you you're in the clouds because you don't know what's going on i have no idea what's going on i just checked clear courts before i made this video and i keep checking it daily um my queen she did a background check on me without even that i like telling me she was going to do it or asking me and she also came up with the same conclusion there's nothing recently <laughs> As a matter of fact, the last in, uh, infraction or the last, uh, you know, file that's on there, it was, it's got my name and it's for something that it, I never ever did because it involved a BMW and it was a parking infraction. I would remember if I drove a BMW, okay, that much I know because if you're driving a luxury car, I doubt you would forget something like that, but so that's something that that's not even me so i've told two people so far irl about the situation i spoke to one whom has had a lot of confrontation with police been to prison has had warrants out for him he told me don't talk don't call and i spoke to somebody else who i from my knowledge has never been uh in trouble or had any any, any maybe a traffic violation i don't know I would imagine because it's so easy to get you know get a traffic violation that's why i don't even like driving because it's too expensive and someone like me who is searching for a job is i can't afford it i gotta you know my budget like i've always have said and I keep repeating it's just the princess and my doctor because as always gotta take care of yourself first where you could care for others and the princess because i would like to try my best to make her life um, enjoyable, you know? That's why, that's another reason why I have, I've been trying my best to um, uh, just project positivity and project um, uh, self-confidence because I don't want her to um, have to struggle mentally or emotionally like I am. So 
it's not that things are all good and well. It's just that I have to try to keep up because there's, I got to think of her. But yeah, so the GoFundMe, that's going to be a, a nay. Public defenders, that's almost like, they're almost like, you know, you, I give them a lot of credit because they take on a lot of work. But at the same time, the majority would probably, would, I would imagine, would like you to just take a, 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 a plea deal. But then again, I don't even know what I'm in trouble for. So, but anyways, thanks for watching. I will see if I can make this in Spanish. I'm not sure. I don't, I don't, I, I don't even like the fact that I have to post about this stuff because... But it's what's happening to me and... Alright, well thank you. Peace and love. Ciao.